What's up everybody, welcome back to another drawing tutorial. So today we're going to be doing a Stormtrooper, particularly First Order Stormtrooper, one of the newer sort of styles of Stormtrooper, okay? So I'm on a landscape page, use a pencil and eraser for these, sketch them out lightly. You can always do your ink on top of pencil, but you can't erase ink. So sketch it out with pencil first. Right, so center point of my page is about here. We're just gonna come up and start with like, this black band that's on the top of the helmet, right? So we'll just mark out our edge. So just like here, and we'll go here, okay? That's kind of the width that we're dealing with. So then we will curve a line. Like so. And then we got another band underneath, right? So it goes across again. We just sort of follow this. Down to there. Okay. And then the top of the helmet, so it comes up from this and around, right? So we'll go. over Boom. down to there okay and then we have another line on the inside that comes across like so and they have these sort of lips or sort of boxes that kind of stick off the top one there one on the other side And I think more just coming down here. So like another one here, and then another one here. Like so, right, so then the visor, okay? So coming down from the black sort of section, so it curves down and up for his nose. And then it comes around the nose part, down. Around again here, up. All right, so this is this kind of visors that they wear. Right, so we have some edges to these glasses. So like coming down this way and around and up towards the nose, to the top of the nose, and then down around here as well. Just like a piece of rubber that sort of holds it onto his face or something. I kind of like that. And then we have the main shape for the rest of the mask, right? So there's like a couple of plates and stuff, but we'll go out from here. So we go diagonal, out from the edge of his mask to there. And then this will come down. So, so real wide. Like that. And then we have like another piece of armor here. And then this comes down around his chin. So it goes down like this. Down like so, and then curves around and goes up to the middle. So it goes up and over and down again. 
Now, various details and things inside here. So we have another piece of armor that like comes out here, plate on his face, and then it goes down like so. Same thing sort of over here, down to there. And then we bring it in, into there. Now, if I go too fast, just use that pause button. And then this curves over his mouth and down to there. So we have this sort of, what would you call it? I don't know, there's a black box or something here. It goes up, down around to there. Cross and up. And then there's like some sort of circle for like a radio or something there on that side. And we'll give it a bit of an edge. Something like this. And then on this side, similar sort of thing. Give it an edge. Like that, and then a circle in there. So then this white armor comes down there just on the inside. And it's black just inside here. It's part of that black rubber sort of shape. It's a bubble one. Okay, and then, yeah, so then this white armor here goes down like so. Okay, so then the inside of his mouth, there. Side of his mouth there. And then this will go up and down. Like so. And so we have like a circle here, like a speaker or something. I guess it is probably a speaker. It's where they speak out of. Like that. And it has an extra line just around to show that it's kind of sitting in the helmet. And then we have some more lines for his mouth. So it goes sort of down this way. Then around here. Goes down and up. Same on the on as the other side. Up to there. Okay, and then there's some black lines here, some gaps or something. So like this. Vents, holes in the mask. Like that, and then there's like another hole here. So it goes up like this. And Right, so I'm drawing this from the FN, you know, Finn FN one eight two or something. So he's got this sort of these sort of scars or like blood marks. So you could do them as blood, I guess. I'll just draw them in just so we know where they are. Now they're done in red. But I'm just gonna draw it in just so we can see 
when we're coloring where it is. Move across there. I'm going to make a couple of spikes there. And then if you want, you can add like some cracks coming down from the mouth, some sort of scratches and things. Dirt some. A sort of battle weary stormtrooper. Those little details always make them better, I think. So, if you wanted to just draw the helmet, you can leave it there. If not, we're we'll going with the shoulders. So, we got shoulder coming out this side. And it's like there's body armor and then shoulder armor. So this is like the body armor. So it comes down there, other side. Comes down like so. And then another like line for the armor here. Going down that way. And then he has a vent here in the middle. So it comes down. And then across, down, like so. And right, so then shoulder armor comes out like that. And then the inside of it comes down around to like here. And then we can see his arm sort of inside here. Like in there, there's like these, this like strap that goes this way. It's all black in here, but there's this rubbery sort of vent or like fabric that's underneath the white part just there and again cracks and things on the armor are always a good addition i think and like scratches and dirt and all this And then the other shoulder, this one comes out a little bit wider. And it's like the shoulder sticks out a little bit more down there, down like so. And around to there. And then that sort of shoulder strap in there. And then some more armor there. You see that it's like more of this rubber stuff, like so. so maybe a bullet hole or something, not a bullet hole. Um, laser beam hole <laughs> right and then basic stuff like just going over your edge lines trying to tidy things up you know thickening up the edge of things in drawings like this can make things look better. He's got a shadow underneath his chin here, like just in here. 
just add this. Like that. Right, but I think that'll do. That is how to draw a stormtrooper. I hope it was helpful, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.